Nikki, excuse me, it says how to address you, Nikki T. Oh, <laughs> what it says on here. Chair <laughs> Bynum, vice chairs, members of the committee, there's only one Nikki T. Uh, thank you for having me. I appreciate the opportunity to briefly share with you some process pieces to this. I certainly couldn't compare to the stories, to the narrative that you've heard from these licensees. Um, I would call out two things. One is you heard from Amanda Metzler, who's a farmer in Southern Oregon. You know what's happening in Southern Oregon. You know what's happening around her legal property, all of the illegal property, human trafficking, fatalities, it's terrible. Why then would we have a policy that condones that same illegal, illicit activity? It's inviting it in. And we shouldn't be profiting off of that. We should be struggling to make sure that we stave that off. The only other piece I would bring forward, and you heard from Michael Gatlin, was that there is a work group. We've been participating for three years in a work group alongside Representative Owens and Senator Finley and Representative Nathanson, Representative Marsh, Senator Golden, Senator Brzezanski. Um, and the conversation is about how we drive these dollars to the cities and counties, our partners who really need this. Uh, that conversation is about to come to a close. Um, we're going to have some public hearings down the hall with Chair Nathanson. I'd encourage you to go and, and talk with her about it. It's going to be great. Um, and we designed this conversation in order to be an answer to this need. So cities and counties, it'll be down the hall. <laughs> uh, I would encourage you all to encourage everybody to take that path, this path we've been working on for so long, um, instead of this um, kind of one-off patchwork quilt that will, as you've heard, harm our industry. Thank you.